windy. Jamie here, Nomadic Rev. Welcome back to another video on my channel. Thanks for following along. We did hit 80 degrees the other day, um, but it was cloudy, and so it helped it feel less hot and humid, I guess, which is kind of the other nice thing about the upper Midwest is even on the warmer days, if it's cloudy, it, it it's more bearable, I guess, than in the south, which, I, which is where I'm headed in a couple weeks. So it wasn't too bad, but I like this better. 58, a little bit of a long sleeve shirt on, and uh, it's just more cozy. I'm looking for a cozy spot right now, actually. This is what happens when you drive in the country. This guy behind me is not having it either. Just be patient, buddy. It's not worth dying over. Have you guys noticed people are so aggressive today when they're driving? And being in a more rural setting like this, it's stressful when I go up into like a urban or urban city place. People are just way too much in a hurry. It's a beautiful night. It is about 58 degrees, which is just perfect for me. I love this weather. It's ideal. Just looking for a little place to uh, hunker down, maybe enjoy a hot beverage and watch a little Netflix. Nothing like a little baseball and another farming equipment up there, although he's turning. Actually, that's the same road I'm turning on. <laughs> See what happens. Guess it's one of those nights. Farmers getting ready for the uh, season. Ah, that's okay. I've always wanted to check this out. It's gonna be a little windy, sorry about the wind. Not that long ago, this lake was frozen solid. Not anymore. What's interesting is there's plenty of room to pull up there. Um, which is interesting. Not sure if that's allowed or not. And then right behind me, there's a little like boat access area. So I'm gonna pull it up on Google Earth and see what I find. All right, well, I just found something interesting around the corner up here. I'm gonna drive over there and see if there's any like signs saying you're not allowed, but looks like a little way stop off the way. Might be the perfect spot for what I'm looking for. I'm curious if it's going to be private property or not. There was nothing on Google Earth that marked it, but I guess I could check a map. See what a map says. We'll find out.
well, that answers that question. No trespassing. Not much of a road either. Although, I'm tempted. Supposedly it goes up around here and then there's like a turnaround up there, but I better not. This guy just passed me, slowed down, got out of his truck, trying to tell, see what he's holding. Might just be a fishing pole. There's a little creek running there. Yep. Just grabbed a pole and walked across the road and he's throwing a line in. Taking a seat too. <laughs> That's not a bad view. If you've ever watched my breakfast video before, um, this is where I shot that video. I think that was probably almost a year ago now. But even this road here that I'm on is still pretty busy. You probably just heard that car go by. So even though I live in a more rural setting, I'm close enough to the cities that it's hard to find a private spot. I decided to move again to chase the sunset down. Look at that. Oh, wow. It's awesome. All right, guys. That's not how I was going to end the video, but... That's tough to beat. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.